windows. Windows, windows, windows. Or more specifically, Windows 10. It's like the gift that keeps on giving. If by the gift that keeps on giving, you mean giving problems. So, I wonder what the weather's doing. Of course, I could look out the window, but I'm too much of a nerd to take my eyes off the screen, so I'm going to do it this way. So here's the weather app. Let's take a look. Hello? Weather? Where are you? Okay, maybe that was just a fluke. Let's try it again. No, nope, it doesn't seem to want to load. Oh well, I've got a bit of maths to do, so I'm going to bring up the calculator. And oh wow, would you look at that. It doesn't want to load either. Oh well, I guess I'll just have a look at some of my pictures then. This one's got a rather interesting title. Let's take a look. Isn't that lovely? We have an error. You know what I think's caused this? I think an update caused this. Let's see what version of Windows 10 I'm running. We'll go into my settings here, and system, and about. Now, last time I checked this, I was using version 1909. So, let's scroll down, see what version I'm using. Oh, would you look at that? It's still 1909. So it wasn't an update after all. Windows 10 just likes to mess itself up. So, I think I should use something different. Now, I'm sure a lot of the Linux fanboys out there right now are going, Join us! Join us! Praise Lord Linus! Well, no. I'm not going to go over to Linux. And you know why? One reason is this thing. I mean, come on, what is this, the 1980s? Nobody types into their computer to make it do things anymore. We're not in the days of DOS now. Okay, I know technically the terminal isn't DOS, but I prefer a GUI. Because I can actually see what I'm doing with icons and buttons and even text dialogue that I can actually interact with with my mouse. That's how I want to use my computer, not typing in a bunch of stuff, because normal humans, like me, aren't familiar with the Unix way of doing things. I'm sorry, but that's the way it is. Also, there is a lot of stuff that I cannot run on Linux. Can't run this on Linux. Can't do this on Linux. Can't run 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 this on Linux. And I cannot mod my games on Linux. So I cannot do anything like give Knuckles his hat back and go super whenever I want. Now I'm sorry I went into a bit of a rant there about Linux, and I'm sure I've lost a few subscribers for that, but hear me out. I don't actually hate Linux. I know there's a lot of things it can do. The thing is, the things that Linux can do that Windows can't do, I don't need. Okay, yeah, sure I could install a virtual machine, and run my Windows programs that way. I mean, check this out. I've got Windows 10 and Windows XP on the same desktop at the same time, which is pretty cool. But the thing is, if I did that on Linux, it would just kind of defeat the point of using Linux. I might just as well use Windows. So this is what I'm going to do. But Excuse me. I'm going to be checking out Windows 10 AME and going to be doing it on real hardware so we can 
actually see what this can do. So join me in the next video where I'll be installing Windows 10 AME because I'm sure this video is like 4 million hours long already. So next video being uploaded right now. Oh, she's cold. Bless. Well, I could certainly warm her up. There, hot enough for you? Obviously not.